Good morning, everyone. This is Rice Miller coming back at you with yet another fast food fave. And I'll be honest, I do feel bad. I haven't been doing, or you know, I've been teasing the, I've been teasing the, the subscriber special, and y'all are, y'all have been waiting patiently for it, some more patiently than others, I will say. Um, but I owe you guys something as a little bit of a, a little bit of, um, kind of cleanse a little mama, um, umami, something good for you, something that is, uh, as something that is uh, a, a, a little gluttonous, maybe, for some reason you guys like it when I overeat. Well, some of you do, some of you don't. Some of you pretend like you don't, but you still click the video. Like, if you don't like me overeating, why do you click? Why do you comment? Why do you leave engagement? That helps the algorithm, dudes. If you don't, if you don't want me... If you don't want me to do that stuff, don't click on it. Instead, click on my videos where I do stuff that's fun, like, you know, the propped up and stuff. Encourage me to be more creative than, uh, bestial. Anyway. But today on the docket, we're going to something that is, uh, speaking of bestial, oh lord. Oh, I might have done make a terrible mistake. So, one of my favorite things to do on my days off is go to the uh, local Chinese buffet. And they have a takeout area. And they have a takeout thing where you can basically just pay for it by the pound. They charge about nine fifty per pound when you include seafood. I paid... Twenty-four dollars for this. I believe it was twenty-three sixty-one total. So yeah, today on the DACA we have ba -da -ba -ba, an all-you-can-eat buffet in a box. Out of the box, di -di, out of the box. Any millennials remember Playhouse Disney back in that era? Oh lord. Okay, so what is in here? I think a better question is what isn't in here. Uh, we have rice noodles, uh, uh, lo mein, uh, chicken, sushi, spicy squid. Now, let's just get a little squid. Mm. Chews like a rubber band, tastes like seafood. But, so, what's gonna ha how are we gonna do this? Well, we're just gonna keep eating until either this box is empty or I'm about to burst. Two pounds of food. Let's do it. Mm. Mm. Oh, turn this off for a bit. My shoulder is getting cold. Well, my elbow. Now, I love the things that at a sushi, at a Chinese restaurant that you don't normally expect. Like, here is some cream spinach. Mm. Topped with cheese. And sadly, one of the only greens in this box that's not connected to some something grossly unhealthy. Then again, it is actually grossly unhealthy anyway, because it's got cheese and cream in it, huh? So there's the lo mein and the pepper chicken. Okay. Now, I'm, I'm going to try to avoid saying where this place is because for some reason people are obsessed with trying to dox me. In fact, I have a funny story about someone's attempted fail to dox me, but I don't really want to tell it because it would involve talking about some other stuff that, I'm, that I've done. I mean, it's not actually that big of a thing. Okay. If you pay for Google One, 
Google will give you alerts when, um, your name pops up in relevant searches. Or relevant to you. My name popped up in a review for a hotel in a different state. I reported it, and, um, yeah. And then I got an email from two other Royce Millers, there's like ten of us in the country, saying that they had been harassed by people trying to call my number and calling them instead. Oh, these are red bean mochi cakes with, that are fried in government sesame seeds. And it's like, dudes, calm down, leave me alone. Like, you're not harassing me, you're harassing other people. Mmm. That's black pepper chicken, it is amazing. Oop, yeah. well, I should not have worn black today. Um. Speaking of chicken, the other chicken we have is scallion chicken. Mmm. The scallion chicken is stir-fried with scallions, obviously. Yeah, it's basically... It's basically French onion soup chicken. It's delicious. Mm. You know, I try to eat cleaner at the, if I do eat, eat at the buffet, because it's like, I don't want to look like a pig, but here I'm allowed to let the foods intermix a little more, and it really does work, like, the spicy squid chopped onto the scallion chicken is delicious. Mm. Alright, time for our first bit of seafood. Or a bit of sushi. A seaweed salad roll in fried in a fried uh, tofu wrapper. Mm. Mm. The the tofu is sweet and and it has a bit of a sweet teriyaki flavor. This the seaweed salad is briny. The rice is good. Mm. And then we have some, looks to be, looks to be a crab, or looks to be a crab roll, crab leg roll with, or you know, the, the, the mock crab roll with some, uh, extra mock crab on top, along with some, like, little, uh, tempura bits. Ooh, that scallion chicken. I tell you, that scallion chicken tastes really good. I did not realize how good it would taste even outside of the buffet environment. I don't know how much of this is authentic uh, Chinese cuisine and how much of it's like, you know, or Asian cuisine, I should say. And how much how much of it is just stuff they made up off the top of their head. Like, I've, I've never heard of spicy squid before, but it's good. bigger the squid that they're getting rings that big off of it. I mean, you know, I was saving this for my, uh, eventual fast food fave of calamari, but, um, I know there's no fast food calamari, but bear with me for that one. Um, but there's that old <coughs> wives tale about how 
they'll use uh, pig anus as a replacement for uh, the for the suckers. That's and that's complete horse hockey. Like the, the, people are just mean. Trying to get your goat. Here's one that I don't know if anyone has ever seen before, but anyone here has ever seen before. Oh, that got a little messed up, didn't it? But it's a uh, it's a rice roll with sweet egg on top. I always thought this was sweet tofu, but no, it's it's egg, which I'm a little uh, about, but eh, whatever. Uh, ooh, a crab rangoon, which uh, covered in stuff right now, but. I do worry that people are going to try to make me, like, the object of their ridicule, like some kind of, like, uh, Sonichu thing. Like, I don't know the whole story about that, but at one point that person was being, like, harassed by the entire internet or something like that, and allegedly that's what drove them insane and for made them do the things that they did, which I don't know if I necessarily believe that, but... Still, the, the internet is extremely cruel for little to no reason. Mm. Man, it's so weird how much the, these, these tastes change outside of the and buffet environment. I wonder how Golden Corral would taste. Like, I had no idea how salty that scallion chicken was until I had it in front of you just now. Mmm. More squid? I tried to avoid the eggs with rice noodles because like I don't I don't trust buffet eggs. I mean it did just have a sweet egg, but whatever. Y'all be like, oh, I don't trust seafood on a buffet. I'm like, I don't trust eggs on a buffet. Now we're getting down to the meat and potatoes. Literally. Potato. They've got twice bakes. Mmm. Bacon and cheese. Sour cream. This is going to be the worst thing I eat. One, it's nothing but starch, fat, and cream. And dairy, I mean. And two... Those are all things that aggravate my uh, digestive issues. I suffer for you. And believe it or not, that leaves us with nothing but sushi. Now, it may not look like it because this is such a mess, but it is, in fact, sushi time. Ah! Here's 
a strange yellow wrapped one topped with some salmon with a little crab roll in there. Oh. I'm not sure what the yellow is. And then here's a here's a uh, yeah, here's a another California roll with a yep with a pink wrapping this time and more more raw salmon on top of this time with a little caviar as well. This one is raw whitefish, um, and it looks to be, I don't know, some kind of like maybe pickled radish and crab. Here's a spicy tuna, always a classic. Mm. <laughs> Here's one of my favorites. They take yesterday's sushi, like they refrigerate it overnight, and then in the morning they deep fry it. Perfect use reuse of material. Mm. Very rich though. Sorry, this is just gonna become a sushi eating stream for a bit. I'll save I'll save the last deep fried one for last. Here's another salmon roll with uh, caviar on top. Meh. Here's another yellow roll. Get another tempura fried roll. Hmm. Oh, Lord, I'm starting to get full. Well, I, I started to get full about 10 minutes ago, but. Ugh. Here's a shrimp roll. Um, or crab roll, I should say. It's similar in style to the egg roll, but. Or to the eggs, to the egg, to the sweet egg roll, but. It's got one of those mock crab legs instead. Then put a shrimp roll with sesame on the outside. Excuse me. Temporal. And Last but not least, the other Jim Pearl. Oh. I haven't eaten that much since the 4K special. I hope y'all enjoyed this. Um, oh, and remember, okay, so and just so you know, the the five K special is coming. I'm waiting to get 
some home movies from my dad to review so I can get a better picture of what's all there in my brain. And I'm hoping to get my brother in on it, but I don't think he'll be in it. <sighs> ah, well. Anyway, that's going to be it for me today. Ugh. Oh, no, I think I'm going to puke. You all have a good one. This is Roy Smeller. I'm Audi.